spotlight. We all know what a good kiss looks like, and most of us know what a good kiss feels like. But reporter Joel Achenbach asked the question, why do people kiss? People kiss because they're recreating their behavior as an infant. When you're a child, when you're a little baby, you, you nurse. Mm -hmm. that, the mouth is designed for that. And a lot of things we do as adults are recreations of our infantile behavior. Really? Hmm. Well, here's a scientific you know, one for you. Why are there only two sexes? Sometimes you think, well, why, why isn't there three sexes or four sexes? You know, I, I can't figure out what a third sex would look like. <laughs> you know, I know a few people who are maybe, but you know, I, I keep wondering, why is there not, you know, a hundred sexes? Mm -hmm. And the answer is because two is enough. If you have two sexes, you can recombine genes in, in almost any way, and it makes the world complicated enough. Complicated it is. So you wonder, how does Achenbach know the answers to all these pressing questions? Well, it's not because he's omniscient. It's because he goes to the experts and asks why. Why is the best question. It's the deepest, biggest, most profound question. It's a lot better than what or how. Okay, let's move on to perceptions. Why do Americans think the British are so smart just because they have those accents? <clears throat> In the words of one of my more sympathetic correspondents, it has turned out to be an annus horribilis. We like to think of the, of the Brits of, as being, uh, you know, the sort of masterpiece theater existence, you know, um, mm -hmm. but it's, it's sort of a, an illusion. Well, I guess that's mm -hmm. nothing to sneeze at. <laughs> so why do people sneeze? It's very, it's very strange to find someone who researches these things and they say, well, we don't really know why people sneeze. <laughs> Bless you. Well, Achenbach might not have the answers to everything, but you'll see he never stops asking why. Well, why don't trilobites come out of the ocean now? Okay. Apes, how come apes don't evolve into human beings anymore? You always hear about how they evolved into humans. Well, they, as far as I can tell, they're just being apes. You know, why is that? 